good morning uh, today i'm going to clear a small doubt which navin asked me the other day and it is uh, regarding how how to add a door on a curtain wall system so uh, once if you uh, add uh, add a curtain wall using a uh, wall and curtain wall how to add a door to it so it's a very simple process but it will confuse many including me uh, first okay i'm creating a curtain wall which you need for me to explain this so this is a curtain wall uh, it is a curtain wall when i select it says curtain wall uh, this is unconnected height is 8000 i don't need it you need only 4000 so i'm just adjusting the height of the wall now this is the interesting part when you turn into um 3d sometimes it will go un- invisible and you know got got create a confusion for you uh, so it is since it is a single wall uh, with no partitions sometimes it will go missing and that's what happens sometimes so here uh, you have this wall 4000 mm high this is the length of the wall so how to add a door now first of all you have to uh, add a curtain wall door you cannot add a regular door here like you cannot select this door and say click on this and add this door because it it will not work because this is a regular single flush door which has to be kept on a, a brick wall or concrete brick wall or whatever it is not to be kept on a glass so that is the first problem secondly um so how to import the curtain wall door you have to go to insert load family and go to your folder where you have saved all these things rvp2 2014 libraries us metric doors the doors i just had a single flush door uh, so i am adding these things curtain wall single glass curtain wall double glass all these things i'm just adding because i want it there so i have added two um okay so how do you check whether it is added you just have to go to family door and see whether it is added so it is added you can see it single flush door curtain wall double glass curtain walls single glass you have all that similarly you have windows also i'll show you that where did we go door yeah so you have store front double glass I'll just add this so that i can teach something else also okay windows so here in window you have a similar one mm. just go through it and see where you have round opening sliding fixed okay we don't have the curtain wall window saved here so i am searching for it in internet somewhere from any of these sites you can just download it for the curtain wall yeah these are all for the curtain wall so you can download any of these any of these you can use
or you need to join forget it i'll go to revit city and download Button all window system horizontal slider. It's clearly mentioned over here. It will work right from Revit 2011 itself. So you can just click this. Okay, and join or log in to download. So I'm keying in my password. Just joining. So while it downloads, I'll just show you how doors are added. So you just have to select uh, here and then go to architecture, go to say curtain grid and add a segment. So when I add a segment here, it's a vertical segment. I want to add a horizontal one. So I'm giving a horizontal one. Okay, you can, after adding, you can adjust the height of this horizontal segment. Okay, so that's somewhere here. You can add multiple vertical segments. So I'm adding it uh, so that, okay, so you can add it like this and what you have to do is select a place where you can add a door. So how to do it, go zoom in, press tab and select, zoom in, go close to it, press tab and select. Once you select, you have the uh, type of doors which you want, just add it. Okay, if you want it in a broader place as double door, okay, so you can select one of this. You can, so this is a glass door without the frame, this is the one with the frame. So you can go on like that. Okay, well, I check this one whether it will download it. Ah, now it is. Kind of taking time to download. Hmm. So it is download, it's downloaded here. Okay came to a download folder from where I'm going to place it in sorry, C colon RVT 2014 which is nothing but my library folder oh it's already there button wall window it is already there okay I didn't notice it so I can show you how to add the window also. So what I'll do is I'll add a I'll add a place for it. I'll add a what did I do? I did when for curtain grid, added a line. Add a line, add a line here. So this will become the best place for you to add a window. So this is a kind of a window. I'll add one more here. So I will use tab to select. Then 
I'm just confused with the names. Uh, I'm not getting which is a wall and which is a window and which is a door. Not this. Okay. This is all in this category. Where did it fall? From this on the copy and go to D. Sorry, C. Not two thousand fourteen. Libraries use metric windows. What is it? Written wall window or some sliding? Okay, I think I have not in imported the library. I said I'll go to insert load family. I will go to C and RVT 2014 libraries. Here's matrix windows, and here we have slider window. So it is imported into this. Now you can add it. So you can select this and say slider. So that gets added over there. Okay, this is added upside down. It is supposed to be facing inside. The slider should be inside. So I just changed it by hitting the space bar. So here we have. Okay, so now here's a new problem. When you add that, these all became split. Uh, so I didn't notice that before adding this. So what you can do is you can delete this by selecting and you can only add whenever necessary wherever necessary you can go to curtain grid one segment because you don't have to set all segment you have to give one segment wherever necessary you just give it so that you can add window wherever you need and so these things you can single glass window yeah so you can add whenever wherever you need all you have to do is select here and go to one segment and click wherever necessary don't give the entire row so that it doesn't spoil your door those it doesn't spoil your doors so that's about adding a curtain wall window on a curtain wall okay so it is done very easily also uh, you can add other other things like you know you can, you can add something here you can select this and you can select this and you can make this solid glass so that you no know, say that you'll find that these two are solid or you can give alternative of all these things are solid I, just in case you want privacy in this area you can have a solid glass you can select this like how i'm selecting press control and go on selecting whatever you want select here and give solid glass so that will all become uh, mm -hmm. solid it, it will not be transparent the other areas are transparent sometimes we'll come up with this idea of you know having so you have all around the door you will have a, um, something solid you can always use tab for, oh sorry you can always use tab for selection I selected all the things around the door solid that look interesting these are the things you can do along with that okay so I think everyone understood uh, how to add a curtain wall door or curtain wall window or add solid solid glazing mm. the most important thing you have to add a grid for a curtain wall otherwise you cannot do it okay thank you Thanks for